Hey guys, it's Erin. For my first Halloween nail design, I'm painting a jack-o'-lantern, so I'm starting off with an orange base. Then with a yellow nail polish and a small brush, I'm creating three vertical lines down the sides of my nail to create the lines of the pumpkin. Once that's dry, I'm going in with either black nail polish or black acrylic paint, and I'm adding the details to the jack-o'-lantern face. Here I'm doing two triangles for eyes, and then adding a toothy smile. Then I'm adding the green top of the pumpkin at the cuticle of my nail. Finish the design with a top coat. For this next design, I'm starting off by painting my nail white. Then I'm going to make this nail into a candy corn, so I'm taking a yellow nail polish and creating a thick horizontal yellow stripe across the middle of my nail. Then I'm doing the same thing with an orange nail polish at the bottom of my nail. Finish with top coat and there's your really easy candy corn nail art. For this nail, I'm starting off with an eggplant purple base. Then with black acrylic paint, I'm creating a semicircle at the bottom of my nail for the head of a cat. Add two triangles for ears. And then I'm adding two yellow dots at the bottom for its eyes. Add a small teardrop shape in the center of the eyes. Finish with top coat and there's your spooky little black cat. For this nail, I'm taking an olive green. Then once my base is dry, I'm taking the eggplant purple again and I'm creating a triangle down the center of my nail for a witch hat. Add the base of the hat at the bottom of your nail. Then once that's dry, I'm adding a little detail to the brim of the hat with some black acrylic paint and then adding a little buckle with a yellow nail polish. And of course, finish with top coat. For this nail, I'm using a sheer pink for my base. Then I'm taking white nail polish and I'm creating some wavy teardrop shapes all across my nail for little ghosts. You can add as many as you want in various sizes. Then once my ghosts are dry, I'm creating two black oval shapes and then a small black circle shape to create the eyes and the mouth of the ghosts. and finish with top coat. For this next nail, I'm using a bright green base. Then with black acrylic paint at the cuticle of my nail, I'm creating a semicircle shape with a jagged edge to create the look of Frankenstein's hair.
Then once I'm done with the hair, I'm taking a red nail polish and creating a diagonal line across my nail and, that, and then adding short little jagged lines coming off of that for a little bit of stitching. And finish with a top coat. There is your finished Easy Frankenstein nail. For this next design, I'm using a white base again. Then I'm going to paint a little skull, so I'm starting off by painting these two angry eye shapes. Then I'm adding some details to the sides of my nail to where the skull kind of cuts in at the jaw and filling that in with black. Then I'm adding a horizontal line and shorter vertical lines for the teeth. And lastly, adding a nose. Finish with the top coat and there you have a skull nail design. For this nail, you want to start by painting your nail red. Then I'm putting one big black dot at the middle of my nail and a smaller black dot above it. Then to create the legs of the spider, I'm doing four legs on each side, two pointing up and two pointing down. You want to make them kind of bend at the ends, so I'm just creating a little angle there. And once you finish painting the legs, finish with the top coat. For this next design, I'm painting my nail black. Then I'm taking a matte top coat and painting that all over my nail. And just wait for it to dry down. Once my nail is completely matte, I'm taking a glossy red and adding some blood drips. The matte base just really makes these drip pop and look even more gory. This design has a white base again. Then I'm painting a big blue dot at the center of my nail. And once that's dry, I'm putting a smaller black dot on top of that. Next, I'm going in with a red nail polish and adding some jagged lines around the edges of my nail to make the eye look bloodshot. Finish with a top coat and there you have your eyeball nail. And there you have 10 easy Halloween nail designs. We hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to see more from Cute Polish, you can click the boxes here and click the circle here to subscribe to Cute Polish for a new video every week. You can also click the circle here to subscribe to my personal nail art channel.